Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to upload an image into GeoGebra. What I just did was I did a Google search on famous buildings in China because they do have so many cool buildings and the shapes of the buildings are amazing. So I think I'm going to go and use this picture right here. It looks like um, a drum and I want to take a snipping tool of it. So um, a snip of it before I put it into GeoGebra. I just want to let you know there's different ways of doing this. There's like right click and doing copying image and that's not how I'm going to do it. I'm going to go to my snipping tool that I have on my computer. If you're running a Windows um, 8 you just go to your um, window on the side and search for a snipping tool. I clicked on my snipping tool and see it's, it's right here. See it's all gray. If I cancel it goes back to a color. So I go to gray and I'm just going to snip the part that I want. And then I'm going to go here and I, oops, I got to do that again. Sorry about that. And I'm going to save it as I usually save it on my desktop as capture because in my class I rewrite over and over. It doesn't matter where you save it as long as you can find it. So there, there we go. And now I'm going to open up my GeoGebra program and I'm going to show you how to put it into GeoGebra. Um, I have this down here. So I insert image, click down, and it's to capture, and I'm going to open it. Now from here, you might change your object properties. To make it a background image, I usually go to object properties and make it a background image, and then I sometimes I'll make it lighter while I'm doing my mathematics, and then position. Now if you have a Mac, this, 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 this white screen white um, rectangle is really really small but it's the same thing you write down for all computers write down corner square bracket one corner I'm making it full screen corner square bracket two and corner uh oh square bracket four enter and there we go now I showed you how to upload an image and make it into a background and full screen I hope this helps you and I hope this helps you with your classes that you have in your geometry class. Thank you.